hey everyone welcome back to the channel today i will show you how to install ubuntu on windows 11 using virtualbox so first we have to create a virtual machine to create a virtual machine follow the following steps step one open the virtualbox software and click on new to create a virtual machine for ubuntu step two after that name your machine and select the type of operating system as linux and the version that you had downloaded 32 bit or 64 bit after selecting all this just click next step three assign the amount of rom you want to give to your Ubuntu virtual machine 4 gig in the recommended one however for better performance you can allow more if your host system Windows 11 has enough spare memory block step 4 create a virtual hard disk let the default option be selected and just click on to create button step 5 here you have the option here you have the option to select the hard disk file type simply choose vdi or virtual disk image and click on next step 6 now you have to all allocate storage on the physical hard disk select dynamically allocated and allocate 50 to 100 gig of storage and finally click on create and that's it this is how you can create a virtual machine for the ubuntu operating system now installing ubuntu on virtual box now our virtual machine is ready for installation to install ubuntu and on virtual box follow these steps step one Select the operating system name in VirtualBox. Then click Settings, Storage, Control ID, Empty, Optical Drive. Step 2. Now click on the Optical Drive drop down menu and select Choose Disk File. Select the Ubuntu ISO image file from your downloaded location, then click OK. Step 3. Now, to install Ubuntu on virtual machine, select your virtual machine name and click the start button. After that, it will open the Ubuntu installation windows. Here you have to set up your Ubuntu installation. For that, follow the below steps. Step 1. On the bottom, you will find the show application option with 9 dots. Just click on it and search for settings. Step 2. Open settings, click on the search icon and search for display. Under the display option, you will find the resolution option. Step 3. Click on resolution and select resolution depending upon your default computer resolution and after that click apply and keep change. And that's all. I hope this video helped you guys. For more videos, subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thank you for watching. See you again.